of makeup too and today I'm going to be doing a little like overview of all the hair products that I use. Um, so I'm actually on the lookout for a new drugstore brand shampoo and conditioner and the most recent purchase that I made was this brand. Um, it's the Tea Tree Mint Shampoo and Conditioner from Organics, and I originally heard about the coconut milk one, but um, I got these at Ulta for like $6.99 each, and for some reason, this the Tea Tree Mint one was the only one that had the bonus conditioner size bottle for the same price as this one in the conditioner so yeah I uh, jumped on that really quick <laughs> but also the um this has peppermint oil in it which I heard is like stimulates the scalp and so I also wanted to try it for that as well so I I've been using this for well I used it for about two weeks or so and I did like the fact, like you can really like feel the tingling sensation um, from the peppermint oil. Um, but other than that, I really wasn't too impressed. In fact, I don't really like this um, that much because even with a ton of conditioner, my hair still felt like really dry and coarse and I just did not like it so organics I don't know about the other stuff like the coconut milk one they have like a pomegranate one and stuff like that but um, after using this uh, I don't even think I'm gonna bother with any of the other the other ones um, so that was a fail for me so my go-to, before that, my go-to um, shampoo and conditioner drugstore brand was the Suave. And this is in the almond and shea butter. And I love the smell of these. And as far as, like, getting my hair nice and smooth and soft and all that, it's really, like, I'm really um, happy with the results. Um, but, you know, I got bored, so I want to try to find something new. Um... So I actually was thinking of trying the Yes to Carrots line next. So if any of you guys have feedback on the, sh the Yes to Carrots shampoo and conditioner, um, go ahead and leave a comment down below and let me know what you think, um, whether I should buy it or not. And also, if you guys have any other suggestions on a good uh, drugstore brand shampoo and conditioner, let me know that as well. And I'll um, go and pick some up. But, um, <clears throat> okay, so those are like the drugstore brands. And then uh, my sister, actually... I don't know if you guys saw my other video. She is a hairstylist and she works at an Aveda salon. So of course she takes advantage of her employee discount and picks us up um, some of their Aveda products. Um, so for a while uh, I was using their, this isn't the shampoo and conditioner. I'm actually out right now. We have to get a refill but um it's the smooth infusion line from Aveda they're in the blue bottles and um yeah before I picked up that organic stuff I was this was like my go-to uh shampoo and conditioner and I'm really happy with it and um yeah I just really like it and so I use the Smooth Infusion Shampoo and Conditioner regularly. And then like once a week, I use this stuff. 
This is the Scalp Benefits Shampoo and Conditioner. And this is more of like um, a deep cleaning. And it gets rid of like all the residue and stuff in your hair. So yeah, once a week I'd use this. And then the rest of the time I'd use the Smooth Infusion Blue Bottle Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, but for a while, I, I actually, I've had this stuff for forever since Je no, June of last year when I got my Brazilian blowout, I needed a sulfate free shampoo and conditioner. So my sister picked this up and it came with shampoo and then conditioner the same size bottle and then this stuff and yeah shampoo and conditioner no um complaints at all good stuff um it is a little pricey though so even with my sister's discount um yeah so i mean it's good stuff but this and I don't know why I haven't picked this up before. And I've had this for, what, six, seven, eight months now. But this is the Purology Hydra Cure. It's an intense moisture hair mask. And I tried this for the very first time this past weekend. And I just absolutely love this stuff. Like, the smell is amazing. And, well, as you can see, my sister's been digging into it. <laughs> so she's been using it, of course. Um, it's a little more than halfway gone already. But, um, yeah, like I said, though, I've had it for about six or seven months. And I still have that much left. Like, it's, like, up to here. So a little goes a very long way, and I just love this stuff. It gets my hair so super soft, and yeah, I just love it. <laughs> so I will probably be repurchasing this. Um, and so that's it for shampoos and conditioners, and then... Um, serums yeah these are my go-to hair like heat protectants this is the style prep smoother and I use this more for when I like blow dry my hair and then this is the glossing straightener for when I flat iron and yeah no complaints about these either so good stuff there and then um, I've also been using my Oscar Blondie hair serum that I got in, I think it was January Birch Box, but I'm not sure, I think. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've been using this as well. Actually, this, since I got it, I've just been using this. I haven't been using like the Aveda stuff. And yeah, I'm still just right here. Like I, that's, I've only used that much so far. So, same thing with this too, a little goes a long way, and does kind of help that um, I have <laughs> pretty short hair too, so. Um, yeah, so that's all the hair stuff that I use. Um, again, if you guys have suggestions on a good drugstore brand that I could try, go ahead and comment down below. Um, and then if you have any feedback on the Yes to Carrots uh, line, I'd love to hear that as well. So that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.